what's up guys and welcome back to our channel in today's video i'm gonna teach you how to use teams option which is called remote play so make sure to stay until the end of the video but before we move on it would mean a lot if you subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell on so how to use it and what is it we are gonna talk about it immediately so steam remote play works uh, basically by connecting you to a game on one computer when the game process is actually running on another computer elsewhere through steam game audio and video is captured on the remote computer and sent to the device the game input which is keyboard mouse and gamepad is sent from the device you are using to the game process on the remote computer so how can you see if a game supports it all steam games can be played streaming between your own computers if a game supports a remote play together or has been identified as a good game for streaming to devices using the steam link app that will be listed on the game stream store page in the game details how to use it well uh, basically remote play anywhere if you can just log into your steam client on the computer with the installed game you wish to play then log into steam on another computer or a supported device with a steam link app installed from there you can launch and play the game remotely from the steam library if you want to remote play together launch your game make sure your friends are logged into the steam from a supported device open your steam overlay in game which is shift and tab simultaneously then from your friends list right click your friends and select remote play together and once your friend accept the invite they will be in game with you how to disable the remote play basically it allows access to the host computer outside of the game being streamed because you are logged into your steam account on both computers it is assumed that you have full access to both computers if you don't want a remote steam session to be able to access your computer you can easily turn off the feature in the steam remote play settings so guys overall that's the entirety of the process thank you so much for watching and see you in our future videos goodbye